Welcome back to another exciting episode where we dive deep into the world of Android development with Jetpack Compose. Today, we're going to create a sleek and modern bottom navigation bar. Let's get started. First, add the dependency named Navigation Compose in Module App. Let's look at our data model, Navigation Items, which we'll use to represent each item in our navigation bar. Here, we will have a data class that will store our name and logo for the navigation elements. Now, let's make the view folder where we will store the navigation bar view and the three screens. Okay, now, let's open up our navigation bar, KT file. We're using Material 3 components to build a custom bottom navigation bar. Let's break down the code step by step. First, initialize a navigation controller that will be used to manage navigation. We define our navigation items. These are the items that will appear in our bottom navigation bar. Each item has a name and an icon. Next, we use Remember Savable to keep track of the selected item index. This allows us to maintain the state even when the configuration changes. Here, we will setting the screen title based on the selected item index. When selected item index, this is a Kotlin when expression, which is similar to a switch statement in other languages, cases 0, 1, 2, 
These correspond to the indices of the items in the bottom navigation bar, based on the value of selected item index. The screen title is set to Home, Dashboard, or Notifications, else Home. This is the default case, which sets the screen title to Home if selected item index doesn't match any of the specified cases. The Scaffold Composable is the backbone of our UI. It provides a structure for the top bar, bottom bar, and content area. Let's look at the top bar first. Fill max width. This modifier makes the towpath bar take up the full width of the screen. Title sets the title of the towpath bar to the value of screen title. Top app bar defaults dot top app bar colors. This sets the color scheme for the top app bar and container color. This specifies the background color of the top app bar, which is set to the primary color from the theme. Clip. This modifier applies rounded corners to the top app bar. Here, the rounded corner shape has 0 dp radius for the top corners and 15 dp radius for the bottom corners, creating a curved bottom edge. Actions. This parameter allows you to add action icons to the top app bar. Navigation bar. This composable creates the bottom navigation bar. Container color equals material theme color scheme primary. Sets the background color of the navigation bar to the primary color from the theme. Modifier equals modifier padding. Adds padding to the top of the navigation bar to provide some spacing.
item for each indexed index item and rates over the list of navigation items. Navigation bar item defines each item in the bottom navigation bar. Selected equals selected item index equals equals index sets the item as selected if its index matches the selected item index. On click handles the click event for the item. Selected item index equals index updates the selected item in. Root determines the route to navigate to based on the selected item index. Nav controller navigate route navigates to the specified route and configures the navigation options. Pop up pops up to the start destination of the navigation graph to avoid building up a large stack of destinations. Launch single top equals true ensures that only a single instance of the destination is in the back stack and restore state equals true restores the state of the destination if it was previously in the back stack. Icon configures the icon for the navigation item image vector equals item logo sets the icon image content description equals item name provides a description for accessibility. Tint sets the icon color based on whether the item is selected. Nav controller add on destination change listener adds a listener to the nav controller that gets triggered whenever the destination changes. Destination dot route retrieves the route of the current destination and altogether updates the selected item index based on the current route. Nav host. That will handle navigation between different composable screens. The nav host is tied to the nav controller and starts with the home destination. And that's it. We've built a fully functional bottom navigation bar with the top app bar using Jetpack Compose. You can customize this further to fit your app's design and functionality needs.
If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to Droidscriptor for more tutorials like this. Also, let me know in the comments what topics you want me to cover next. Until next time, happy coding!